And welcome to the channel, everybody. This is Aesop Grimm, and you're watching the continuation of my kind of, I guess, testing out of uh, WoW Retail. So I believe I've just gotten to the Dragon Isles. Um, also, uh, what happened is that kind of in the same week, uh, almost by surprise, because both were blind playthroughs, a little bit more heads up on Elden Ring, but definitely a big kind of just sort of late to figure out that I was closing it out on Cyberpunk. Both of my other two series that I was recording for just wrapped up um, this weekend, either last week or over the weekend. So I don't have any active series that I'm recording. So this is going to take over. Uh, I, I normally prefer to record versus streaming. And I was streaming this, and there are a couple, I think there are two, I'll probably make a playlist out of this, I think there are two streams preceding this, but we're playing as a paladin, Trump Mugshot, and his he's level 11, and like I said, we've just begun on the Dragon Isles. I'm seeing all this for the first time, I'm trying to figure out how to do retail after having missed every single expansion since Wrath of the Lich King. And I quit Wrath of the Lich King about two weeks into it. Um, and then I didn't touch World of Warcraft one iota until uh, around early December of last year, whenever I kind of worked my way into SOD. I, I, I came back, I gave it a shot, I started out in Classic, then I rolled over to Wrath of the Lich King and then I tried WoW SOD, and I've been doing SOD pretty heavily since then. So, uh, WoW Retail then, I, I've, I'm, I don't have any knowledge of the game mechanics and all the different menus and the way that the game has changed over the years through all the various expansions. I have no idea about the storyline whatsoever. Completely lost. And I'm just trying to figure it out as I go. So that's what this playthrough is about. It's, it's, it's messy, it's blind, and it's just supposed to be about... I guess the new player experience basically. But let's go ahead and enter world. And we'll pick up where my last stream left off, which like I said should be right at the initial village on the Dragon Isles. We had just gotten there via ship. All right, so Toddy Whiskers to the Dragon Isles. Got to complete our quest with well, that look one. The wind blew in. Can't wait to see what you discover. Explorers in peril. Don't mistake the expedition's scholarly pursuits as timidness, Trump mugshot. We are not recluses studying books in far off towers. We are adventurers hunting down knowledge firsthand in every corner of Azeroth. That same passion for adventure often leads us into the path of perils and hazards, and a few expedition members have bitten off a little more than they could chew. But hey, the danger makes it more fun. Rescue three dragon scale expedition members in the Wild Coast. And that will give us uh, a follower. Dragon scale expedition renown. Unlock renown levels for the dragon scale expedition faction. Well, maybe in this case it's not a follower, it's just this. And we'll get some reputation also. How can I help you? Thalen is busy tinkering with a gadget in his hands. These explorers are throwing around their grappling hooks by hand. Can you believe that? Imagine if the grappling hook could launch itself automatically when you need it most. Okay, so we need practice materials. Keep those irons in the fire! Collect 15 primal proto whelp scales. Have a good one. Okay, also, Fire what away. do you have for sale? I don't usually buy anything. I don't plan on doing that here. I don't even know what this stuff is. Provides the following properties set the item level to 65 and the required level to 25. Optional crafting reagent. Okay. Uh, is there anything to repair? Yeah, right here. That's what I wanted. Sell all junk. Yes. And then we'll sell the remaining stuff here. So we can clear bag space. Move my hearthstone up to top. 
top left. I guess I'll put that right here for now. I don't have any mods running, no nothing. It's just simply retail, vanilla retail. Oh, I have unspent talent points. Okay. May your flame burn bright. Okay, well, I need to decide which side am I going to go down here? We got Lay on Hands. Heals a friendly target for an amount equal to 100% of max health. Cannot be used on a target with forbearance. And it causes forbearance for 30 seconds. That seems short. Uh, cleanse Toxins. Cleanses a friendly... Yeah, that's nice to have. Fist of Justice. Each holy power spent reduces the remaining cooldown on Hammer of Justice. That should be my stun. It is. Okay, over here we got Divine Steed. Leap atop your charger for three seconds, increasing movement speed by 100%, usable while indoors. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Auras of the Resolute. Concentration Aura. Yep. Devotion Aura. Reducing damage taken by 3%. I might want to have that. Blessing of Freedom I would consider more useful than Lay on Hands at this point. What do we have here? Hammer of Wrath. Divine uh, Hammer that strikes an enemy for 202, only useful and enemies have less than 20%, right? Crusader Aura increases mounted speed by 20% for all party and raid members within 40 yards. That's interesting, but not needed. Obduracy speed increased by 2% and damage taken from area of effect attacks reduced by 2%. Hmm. Greater Judgment. Judgment causes the target to take 40% increased damage from your next Holy Power ability. That sounds pretty strong. Multiple applications may overlap. I, mean, I, I never find myself using Turn Evil back in WoW SOD. Rebuke. Eh, not for a tank, I don't think. Uh, I better make sure it doesn't... it's not different. Uh, same thing. Yeah, so it's it's between here, and what do I want more? Do I want Fist of Justice? Main or do I want Divine Steed? I don't really care about Divine Steed. I do want this. What do we have here? Speed increase by 2%. Crusader Aura was neat. I did want Greater Judgment. Welcome! To the dragon oil, okay, so forest. then this is going to be the best one because then I can move to here and I can take this and that'll allow me to pick this up and this will lead me to here. I'm giving up Lay on Hands. Cleanse Toxins. I don't know if I want to give that up. Can I go the other way? No, I have to take this to get that. Ugh, man, I'm going to take this for right now because I know I want that one. Okay, over here, Avenger Shield hurls your shield at an enemy target, dealing 81 holy damage, interrupting and silencing a non-player target for 3 seconds. Oh, it silences them also? I need to check SOD and see if that's the case there. That would make sense. It's the idea is that you're smacking somebody right in the mouth with your shield. Okay, so we'll apply those changes. And I should have... Okay, there it is. Avenger Shield. And this... I normally have... I'm going to leave it there for right now, but I need to make another toolbar with 1, 2, and 3 on it, because that's how I have it set up for my Paladin on uh, the SOD server. It's actually 1, 2, 3, and 4, and I have macros that double up on, like, it's this, or I hit shift and it's another thing. So, I'll try and duplicate that so I don't ruin my muscle memory for the SOD server. That's a good name for a dragon. That sounds like a dragon name. All right, uh, here we go. What is your report? Azurathel glances suspiciously at the proto dragons lurking on the ridge behind him. And I'd swear that those proto dragons edge closer to camp every time I turn my back. Those are not the dragons Rathian invited us here to meet. Proto dragons are ruthless predators who cannot be reasoned with. We must be ruthless in return. Call their numbers to keep their ambitions in check, or this expedition will be over before it begins. Kill ten primal proto-drakes on the wild coast. Okay. 
So a lot of Shit stuff to do with reputation here. Strong wind. We'd best keep moving. But Raffian said he would meet us at the embassy atop the hill. It may be under attack. If it is, then I will be ready to defend my allies. Okay, let's uh, scroll out a little bit. Uh, mount. Can I fly? I can't fly yet. Alright, fine. Here's the primal proto-dragons. Whoa! Oh, there's a whole group of you. Okay, that's great. And they got rocked. Shouldn't this be auto-looting? Let me make sure that that's, a uh, options, options, auto loot, yeah, it's on, okay. Uh, let's throw a shield in there. Wow, it, it killed him. Oh, it's the whelps, that's why. Six of fifteen scales, new talent point available. Uh, I think I'm level twelve now. All right, what are we gonna do here? We get a point here. Let's go ahead and take Auras of the Resolute. Oh, do I already have it? I do. Oh, okay. Well, then take Crusader Aura, which set me up, sets me up for greater judgment with my next point. Uh, go ahead and activate that. One of ten. Oh, what did I get there? Dragon Isles Supply Bag. Oh, okay. That, uh... Not slotted. What are you? Oh, it begins a quest. Already on that quest, okay. I don't know what's up with the bags not filling out like up here. Oh, it's just a slug. I don't know if I can get up there. I guess I can. Oh, he died slow, man. I feel bad. I thought I thought he was a baddie. Kind of annihilating everything. How did you guys not get hit? I don't have a target. I guess we crit him. Oh, you... No, never mind. Archivist Relid. How come it's not ricocheting? Oh, because it was a judgment. That's a heck of a range for judgment. I'm not throwing my shield. I'm throwing a judgment. There we go. That's better. Okay, 15 of 15 on the scales. Here, let's get this guy. Can I not 
throw my shield up in the air? Why not? Okay, fine. Who's next? The animations are really cool compared to classic. And things feel like they hit harder because those an because of how those animations are done and some of the sound effects. Okay, that was 10 of 10 for them. Now we're just on the rescue part, I believe. That's bad. Okay. Maybe not as bad as I thought. There she is. Okay. Had to come down here anyway. Okay. She lives. Okay. What now? need to get closer. Uh, 170, let's mount up. 170 yards way. To make your acquaintance, Syndra. Well met. Oh, there's a whole village up here. Go first, but I've got a story after. The dragons are nay here to meet us like Rathian said they would. Are not here. Are nay here. Yeah, okay. Let's get moving. I wonder where Rathian is. He said he'd be here waiting for us with an ambassador for Alex Alexstrasza, the life binder queen of the dragons. It does not seem like a dragon to break a promise. Well, at least this eager wee dragon... Dragonid is here to welcome us. Can you talk to him and find out when the others are going to arrive? See you at the next adventure! Definitely more an eastern approach when it comes to dragons, right? Western approach would be the dragons are evil. I kind of miss that. You don't see that anymore. You see a lot more eastern influence where dragons are like... It's like that Nelden Ring, too. Uh, symbols of defense or tenaciousness or good luck and things like that. And I kind of miss just like fighting dragons, being a dragon slayer. Victory lies ahead. Uh, Toddy and Naleda have requested a survey report of the surrounding area immediately. Luckily, I have acquired an enchanted telescope and surveyor's disc that will help us scout out nearby areas from the safety of the clouds. Unluckily, I am 
deathly afraid of heights and cannot bring myself to set foot on the contraption. You are not afraid of heights, are you? Okay, so Death set. to all who oppose us. We can do that right now. Guess. Okay. What now? Search for power, search for allies, or search for danger. Inquire missing dragons, meet scale commander, meet Dalia, blah blah blah. Oh, you gotta do all of them anyway, so. Ley lines. They seem like they're up to no good. Incredible. The elements here surge with power. Okay. Search for allies. Griffins. Dragons. Dragon riders? I gotta race them! I forget what this one was for. Search for danger. Oh my. Kill or be killed society. Okay. Anu Bellore Delana. Salama Ashalanore. You unlock the major faction dragon scale expedition. Outstanding. Syndrax. Looks like we're already doing a quest for him. Ready to serve. Please enjoy your time here. I think I may have already said that no matter. I am just excited you are here. Oh, welcome to the Dragon Isle. Okay, so I've not found Rathi. I'm always here to help. Welcome to the Dragon Isles. Why aren't the dragons here to it meet us? It was nice, yes. I had expected Major Domo Salistra and Rathian to be here by now. Major Domo? But I am honored to be the one to oh, that's welcome a rank. you to the Dragon Isles. <sighs> On my first real assignment, no less. <laughs> what good fortune. Oh, uh, uh, do you need my help? I do not know. As I said, this is my first assignment. Let me think on what to do. Please enjoy your time here. I wish I knew more about how to welcome you to the Dragon Isles, but I'm the only sentry. But I'm only the sentry. Sendrax motions to the tower behind her. You could try talking with the ambassador in the visitor center. He might be able to answer more of your questions before the dragons arrive. Wow, they got a visitor center? This place is getting commercialized real quick. <laughs> Mind your step in there. He was clearing out rubble last I saw. It was so you two were adversaries before leading this expedition together? Ah, uh, ah yes. The Horde and Alliance have a long history of rivalry. But Toddy and I pursue knowledge, not violence. And adventure! Oh, they're going to talk a lot. We're always looking for more supplies, and I know just what we can do with these. You will receive blah. Keep the wind in Okay. And our archaeologist has reported some new findings in regards to a lost artifact suspected to be in this area. If you'll donate those supplies to fund the archaeologist's next expedition, you can have this map that points to a nearby treasure. Okay, sure. Safe passage to you. Thanks. Have you seen my wrench anywhere? Got the have scales. Our artisans will have no problem putting these to good use. Keep those irons in the fire. Uh, one more. Right here. We are the shield of the track here. That sounds like the guy that voiced um, Optimus Prime. 
That may dissuade them from attacking the expedition camps for a time. It's either be eaten in the Dragon Isles, Trumugshaw. You'll do well to remember that. Stay true to your wear. Oh, we just gained another level. Because, why not? Okay. Uh, so, into protection. Holy shield, your block chance is increased by 20%. You are able to block spells, and your successful blocks deal 13 holy damage to your attacker. That sounds like an all-around good talent. Or... Hammer of the Righteous. Hammers the current target for 116 physical damage. While you are standing in your consecration, Hammer of the Righteous also causes a wave of light that hits all other targets within 8 yards for 16 holy damage. Well, that sounds awesome. For a straight-up tanking scenario. I might have to switch to Rhett. I just really like the defensive spec. I think it does pretty good damage on its own. Blessed Hammer throws a Blessed Hammer that spirals outward, dealing 19 holy damage to enemies and reducing the next damage they deal to you by 22. Well, I think I'm going to go with Holy Shield. Okay. Uh, Prismatic Blessing. Dragon Flights grant new adventures their blessings, providing various boons. Well, what did this do for me? It doesn't tell me. It just says it provides various boons. Maybe these are the various. I don't know. Sign of the Twisting Nether. Combat. Okay, reputation gains are increased. Armor. Armor and armor increased and damage reduced significantly. Wow. Damage taken reduced by an additional 3%. So I'm hard as as nails to kill at this point in time. With these buffs plus my spec and the devotion aura and stuff. We have a mission to accomplish. Alright, give peace a chance. Light be with you, Trum Mugshot. This expedition is under the protection of both the Horde and Alliance. Our orders are clear. Give aid to any members of the expedition, regardless of their other allegiances. The Horde's representatives, Warlord Gremax and her daughter Shuja, stand guard on the other side of camp. I fought with Warlord Gremax against the Scourge. She is noble and will serve this expedition well. You'll offer her your assistance. Show her that the Alliance honors its commitments. Okay. Best of luck to you. Not exactly sure how I feel about that, but, uh... If you've done this for 20 years, maybe a little bit of a shake-up is in order. I could see that. Skinning trainer, leatherworking trainer, trade goods. I don't know what I want to do, man. I don't, I don't really know. Maybe nothing. Well, except that you gain stuff from... Like I would get plus crit from skinning. I think I get plus strength from mining. Yeah, I don't know. Um. Welcome, honored guests! My gosh! Tone it down a notch or two. I thought I had to draw my sword. Aha! Potential customer! Show me where I can fly. Wing Rest Embassy, the Walking Shores. You are here. Okay. So I don't have any connecting flight paths, I don't think. Glad I could help. Oh. Excuse me, we need to pick up every quest we can find. We also need to set our hearth, I guess. What service may I offer? I'm a new arrival with the Dragon Scale Expedition. Take this guide. It shows the embassy's many amenities. <sighs> if they weren't all in disrepair, that is. Okay, so they all sound like that. They just kind of sound like they're in combat. <laughs> Finest goods in the aisles. Piandas. Donate to taverns across the Dragon Isles to cover the tab. You will receive... Okay. Everybody's happy about that. Cooking trainer... Alchemy trainer. Description trainer. Oh, yeah, I should probably dabble in stuff I haven't 
ever seen before or haven't seen in years and years and years. Flight master already spoken to. Uh, what's this say? Click to show the Dragon Isle summary. Dream Warden's faction locked. Low Omnifin faction locked. Dragon Scale Expedition is at level 1. Maruk Centaur faction locked. Skyriding skills and unlocks. Not been unlocked yet. And the Valdrakan Accord faction is locked, as well as the Iskar Tuskar. Okay, what am I supposed to do here? Embassy visitor log signed. Okay, I see. There it is. Again, filling out form. Massive tome number indicating it is only the recent and a long archive of such logs. Filled with elegant handwritten form of each visitor to fill out. Okay. The first column asks for your name. I give as little information as possible. I really like anonymity. The middle column asks for your arrival time. I guess today's date. It could be really, really specific. I mean, I wouldn't lie. I just wouldn't be really, really specific here. The final column asks for the purpose of your visit. Uh, uh, I was invited to accompany the Dragon Scale Expedition. I can't remember if we were actually... No, no, the primary mission is to aid the Dragon Flights, if I remember correctly. I'm gonna go ahead and put that. What a joy it is to see new signatures in the visitor's log after all these years. Not that it matters a terrible amount. I'm not expecting that those are consequential decisions. Queen Alexstrasza is far more impressive than any statue you'll find in the Isles. While you travel these Isles, reflect on the... This portion is broken off. Remember our oaths to Azeroth, symbolized in the oath stones that seats of power for each dragon flight. We ask. This part's been broken off for life and for Azeroth. Alex Straza, the life binder, queen of the dragons. Okay. So you can see that they, they're taking their part seriously. And that came from the very top. What am I supposed to do here? Buy archaeologist uh, artifact notes from cataloger Jakes. Ahoy! Brazier of kinship relit. Archaeologist artifact notes. Okay, that's it. It'll cost me ten. Or dra uh, ten Dragon Isle supplies. Okay. Smooth sailing. Thank you. What else am I supposed to do here? Read those notes. Okay. Turn that quest in. Lord Admiral's favor, friend. Find us there later. Okay. Rayana and I will be traveling with Tadi and Naleda to our permanent base camp once they figure out where that's going to be. Find us there later to see our full catalog. Look always to the sea. Gotcha. Uh no other quests that I can see. Introduce ourselves to the horde. Stay focused on our mission. Salute your approach. Captain Garrick proves her honor once more by sending you to me. Never stop training. 
The crafters, artisans, and explorers of the Dragon Scale Expedition are ill-suited to the vigors of battle. But not you and I, Tromugshot. Here in the Dragon Isles, let us use that strength to protect those who can't protect themselves. Clear out the elementals encroaching from the north so that the expedition can focus on their noble pursuits. So we gotta kill 15 of them. Stay strong. Okay. Where am I at? Let's go ahead and do this quest. Oh, look, we can pick up more. Actually, nope, we're gonna go ahead and... We're gonna load up on quests here. But this is a good place to end this particular episode. I am uh, level 13 at the very beginning of level 13. How can I help? Dionysaka. New trade company. Crafting orders network. Wow, what's that? Place an order from some en enchanted mining tools. The tools are crafted, but we would like to test them before completing the order. We will pay you for your services, of course. So we need to test test tools on nearby geodes for the art artisans consortium. Please be careful, friend. Okay. And then you. How are ya? Mining trainer. Uh. Uh. I guess. What's the difference? <clears throat> I think I'll probably try jewel crafting. I guess that inscription <clears throat> might be interesting as well. Uh, I want to maybe keep it simple. I've got a lot to uncover. Dragon Isles mining. Train that also. Okay. See you soon. Always be crafting. Back. Have you ever seen such powerful elementals? I hear the guards grumbling about having to fight them all the time, but they're missing the big picture. Bigger elementals means bigger crafting components. While you're out there clearing the elementals for our safety or whatever it is you'd be doing, be sure to pick up pieces of the biggest ones you can find. I want to try making something out of them. Primal earthen core and primal molten core. Okay. Safe travels. All right, well, uh, before closing this episode out, I want to sell and repair. See what is new. Uh, you don't have anything to sell. Cooking trainer, alchemy, description. I need to find a vendor. Blacksmithing trainer. Herbalism trainer. Uh, trade goods. There we go. Sell all junk items. Do it. And sell that 62 silver wow and I, I guess click here to view your new profession okay, I guess I keep this in my bags I would not really like that I would imagine there's someplace else I can put that okay here's my mining and I have a mining journal about mining skills deposits and specializations also manage your mining equipment there's mining equipment Oh, well, yeah, I mean, the stuff that you mine with. Ceravite deposit. Okay. Oh, and I can drag it to an action bar. Uh, okay. Ok, 
Okay, sold everything I could. I didn't see anything to repair. An option. So, I'm gonna call it good right there. I don't see, uh... I don't see anything else very obvious. I don't hear any anvils getting hammered. So this is uh, this is where we'll pick it up in the next episode. All right, guys. Well, that was fun. 40 minutes worth. Again, I'm Aesop Grimm. Thank you for coming by the channel. I hope you like what you saw. More importantly, I hope all is well in your neck of the woods. I'll see you in the next episode where this story continues.